It is a quarter till eight right now. We've, of course, been talking a lot this morning about how cold it is outside. Hannah Mordeaux is live outside our studio just for a moment to show us how cold it is. You have some demonstrations for us, Hannah, before you run back in and get warm. Yeah, it is so cold, and we figured, well, why not freeze some stuff? Like, uh, this shirt, it's pretty frozen. You can hear it there, really frozen. Also, got an egg and froze it. It did not take long. We did these experiments earlier this morning around 4 a.m. Take a look. It's morning, so let's start with an egg. We've all heard of it being so hot that maybe you can fry an egg outside. Well, we're going to test out it being so cold that you can freeze one. Had to take my gloves off for this one, uh, so I am dying right now, but let's test it out. Cracking the egg, put it on the plate, start our timer. It didn't take long for a thin layer of ice to start forming, and after about 12 minutes, it looked like it was getting there, but we decided to give it a little more time. 23 minutes later, and it looks like our egg is starting to freeze over. If we, oh, it stuck to the, <laughs> it got frozen to that. Okay, fork test that is one frozen egg and now we're going to see what happens when you go from very hot to very cold we've got some boiling water here so i'm gonna throw it oh you see it kind of turns into some snow a floating cloud there i feel like uh, bill nye the science guy this morning next we're going to test out how long it takes to freeze a wet piece of clothing so i have this t-shirt full of cold water here i'm gonna hang it up and it's already <laughs> sticking to the metal, but we'll uh, just set the time and see how long it takes. So it's been about 10 minutes. You can see there are icicles. This was cold tap water and the shirt, oh, it's frozen solid. Check that out. Wouldn't want to jump in cold water and end up like this in this temperature this morning. <laughs> Also probably wouldn't want to be eating this egg. It is rock solid at this point. All jokes aside though, we were taking plenty of breaks as we were shooting that to go in inside, warm up because it is just that cold, wearing multiple layers as well this morning. So I'd say if you don't have to be outside uh, and you don't want to end up like this, I would just stay inside if possible. Live in Indianapolis, right outside the Wish TV studios, Hannah Mordo, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.